Have you been watching the real estate market here in Tracy and been wondering, are we still in a super hot seller's market or are things starting to slow down? Stay tuned. Welcome to Step Into The Valley with Katrina Duke at the Three Step Realty Group. In today's episode, we're gonna be talking about our Tracy real estate market and what's going on. I have a lot of people asking me where the market's going in my opinion. So before we get into that, let's first talk about what's happening right now in terms of homes active for sale. So it is Tuesday at 9.17 a.m. and we currently have 52 homes active and available for buyers to check out and write offers on. Out of that 52, 24 of them came on the market within the last seven days. Okay, also the number of homes pending is 134, which means we have 134 homes that have had offers accepted. Do you remember what that means when you have that many more pending over active? It means we're in a seller's market still. Yes, we are in that seller's market still. Now, let's keep going. The number of homes that sold in June, we had 127 homes sell in the month of June which folks is a lot more than we have been experiencing of the months previous. So let's keep our eyes on what's happening. Out of those 127 homes, the average sold price of those homes, are you ready for this? In Tracy, $754,806. Average sold price in Tracy for the month of June, which is up 5.41% from the month of May, the month before, right before. That's month over month. We're going up in appreciation. Let's look at year over year. So for June of 2021, it's actually up 39.35% from the average sold price of June of 2020. Okay, focusing on one year, let's look at 2021 as a whole thus far compared to 2020 as a whole average sold price. So far to date for 2021, we are up 24.20% from the average sold price of last year for Tracy. So yes, we are still in that appreciation mode. Now the question I'm getting from people are, do I see this still happening? Are we still going up and gonna go up in a dramatic escalation uh, appreciation? Now, of course, let me preface this with, I don't have a crystal ball. Nobody has a crystal ball. But I can tell you what I'm starting to see. I am starting to see not just with my listings and with my buyers, but with other people, my peer realtors and brokers out there as well. We are seeing the number of showings going down. Doesn't mean that it's dropping to nothing. It means that the number of showings that a few months ago that was, you know, 100 scheduled showings is not so dramatically high anymore. It's more normal from what we're seeing. The number of offers is not dramatically high either. It has gone down a bit, but homes are still getting multiple offers. Um, so there's still competition out there going. When I, we see these types of things, it could be for a various number of reasons. It could be not as many people are looking right now because summer's here, kids are out of school and they can finally travel and have fun. It could also be that people aren't out looking as much or more homes are coming on the market. So it's not as competitive, but let me go back and let me emphasize, we are still in a seller's market. It's just starting to feel like a normal seller's market. So if you're thinking about selling your home, give us a call. We would absolutely love to help walk you through how to get top dollar for your home. And if you're thinking about buying a home, we would love to help take you around, walk you through the process and be there for you. In the meantime, subscribe to our YouTube channel because every Friday we get a new video out for you.